Are you trying to launch Minecraft, but it just won't work? It just stays there and will never launch? Well, here's a workaround. Let's get into it. Hey guys, so now I'm going to show you what to do to work this around. So, um, you know it doesn't work on this. So what you're going to do, you're going to close out of this, obviously. You're going to right click on this. Then you're going to select the properties tab right here. Then right here where it says compatibility, you're going to click. And then right here where it says run this game or run this program in compatibility for, you're going to click and go down to where it says Windows Vista. You're going to click there. Then you're going to hit Apply and OK. Then what you're going to do is you're going to double click, obviously, on the launcher. It's going to say Updating Le Legacy Java Launcher. It's going to load you into your Legacy Java Launcher. You're going to say, I'm sure, reset my settings. Then you're going to log in. So let me just log in quickly. Again, you may get this Minecraft news thing. So, um, if you want a select version, mine's running my Optifine version, because I screwed up with something, I accidentally made it in time-lapse, so I already put it to that. But basically, what you want to do if you want to change your version, is you want to go here, Edit Profile, and just select your version, you know, obviously. goes all the way down to Release 1.0, you don't get all those, you can use Allow Old Beta Versions from 2010 to 11, 11. Allow Old Alpha Minecraft Versions from 2010. You can even enable, enable experimental versions. So that's something that it doesn't say on the newer ones. It just You just select historical. So then you do that. Now, I want a disclaimer on this. There are tutorials that say go back. You can go back to Windows 10. So you do the same thing. Right click, select properties, go up to compatibility or Windows 8. And select and turn that uh, run in compatibility with... Then just hit apply and okay, and you can run it back on the same version. But that didn't work for me, so I'm doing this. Then what you want to do is you want to hit play. It actually loads it very, very quickly. Then if you have a loud computer like me, the fan will make noise. Here, let's turn the keyboard on. So the fan will make a bunch of noise. But it should load. Just took a minute there. So maybe take a minute. Depending on how fast your computer is, mine's not very fast. I got 12 gigabytes of RAM, Intel Core i5, 8th generation, 930 gigabyte hard drive. Of course, those fans aren't the hard drive. But it's definitely there. Then I'll load in. We'll get your weird messages. When you hit single player, all your worlds will be there. So as you can see, yep. So then, yeah pretty much just the same as before except the launcher is a little bit different it's actually a lot different than how you select older versions so yeah guys hope you enjoyed like subscribe and i'll see you in the next one peace